Hey everyone, this is Rushlock, and this is a brief video on the new subscriber options now available on Twitch in beta format as it rolls out wider onto the sites in the near future. Uh, I'm using Dijon TP's channel as a, an example again, so I'm already subscribed to Dijon. However, if you're subscribed or not, you can always hit this button, and it'll show you the standard $4.99 subscription that we've always had. And now the two new options are $9.99 and $24.99. And someone's first question might be, you know, why would I want to, you know, pay more for my subscription? You know, what's the interaction? You know, what does the subscriber get? What does the broadcaster get? Things like that. So, benefits to the other sub-tiers. You can click through them here and they'll list the benefits. Uh, the simple version is that each of these tiers, the broadcaster has an option to enable an exclusive emote uh, for each of these tiers. The 999 has one emote that's exclusive to it. The 2499 has one emote that's exclusive to it. Uh, however, the 2499 also includes the 999 uh, subscription uh, emote. Um, that's the simple version for, for in-chat perks. There's no new chat uh, badge. Um, it doesn't break your uh, anniversary, like your, your multi-month uh, combo. Um, also, if you subscribe while your current subscription is still uh, has time on it, for lack of a better phrase, it will not prorate. So be aware of that if you need to time it out for your, your normal subscription to lapse and pick up with your other one. You know, there's, still, there's still a grace period between the two. Uh, I think I read somewhere that it's like 30 days for that combo to break, so you should be fine on that front. Um, also, so let's say you are a Patreon or a GameWisp supporter of your of your you know favorite channel or channels. Um, keep in mind that the direct support is still greater when you use Patreon or GameWisp. Uh, broadcasters do receive a majority share of these tiers, uh, these two new tiers. But it is definitely not the 100% or near 100%, 90 plus percent that you would see on Patreon or GameWisp or things like that. Uh, so keep that in mind as well. There's no right or wrong way to support a channel. It all comes down to what you value as the as the viewer and the supporter. So if chat emotes are of, of value to you or uh, a bigger hook is that you get to stay on platform, meaning you get to support the channel or the broadcaster through Twitch itself as opposed to having it to another website and keeping up with another login and another accounts and things like that. So... Again, it's all in the user side's hands for what they perceive value for, you know, what's worth or not worth for them. Uh, also, again, if I didn't make it clear before, broadcasters have the choice whether or not to uh, add the emotes that are exclusive to these tiers. Some will choose not to do so. Some will choose to do so. Um, but yeah, as always, if there's questions, feel free to put them in the comments down below the video, and we'll see you all next time.